All right, guys. So today on Better Than It Was, uh, doing some work on the truck. I have seat covers in it currently. Had them on here probably over three years now. But you can see they're starting to give out in some spots and they're real faded and just kind of dingy and covered in dog hair and whatnot. So I ordered new ones. Uh, I could have sworn that I ordered gray, but when I called the company, they said, uh, nope, you ordered blue. So I'm gonna have some real bright blue seat covers. Um, luckily it's my favorite color, but in order to get new ones, it would be another five to six weeks. Plus I'd have to go with, or go through returning all of them and all of that kind of stuff. And so I just decided to keep the blue ones and uh, it's gonna be pretty bright. All right, so I'm gonna start out, I'm gonna get these old seat covers out, and then I will clean up the truck, you know, do all the vacuuming and such, and then put the new ones on. So I got the seat covers off. I got the seats all vacuumed off. They did a pretty good job over the past three years of keeping everything clean. Uh, I can see some spots. There was obviously some dust and <clears throat> some material from the old seat covers that was uh, falling off of them. I'll show you here in a second. But got everything cleaned up, ready to put the new ones on. truck I wanted to put seat covers on it and I looked at multiple different options and I liked the waterproof feature because I had a lab at the time and so I went with Neo Supreme which is like a thinner neoprene material and while it held up pretty well you can see here how it separated over the years and the foam backing started um, to deteriorate but overall decent seat covers the new ones that I have are real neoprene, so it's a little bit thicker material, and they should last even longer than these original ones that I had. Yeah, so these are full neoprene, and these are the neosprene. Alright y'all, so there's a reason that I left the front seats for last. That's because on this particular truck, it has two adjustment knobs here and you have to feed it into the two tiny holes. And it is the hardest part of putting these seat covers on. But it's, I would say, 75% done. And so these are the last two that I have to tackle. Okay, so remember how I just said that it was a pain in the butt to get those on? Well, this one the hole was a lot smaller than on this one. So they're super easy, uh, but still the hardest part is putting these front bottoms on. y'all they are all in so a couple of isms with my truck are the back headrests so the ones that come in the stock frontier like they sit way up here and almost block the back window so what you can do is swap them out for Xterra headrests and they're a lot shorter and they sit down so you don't lose any of your visibility out the back window it's really hard to order the 
Xterra headrests when you order the Frontier seat covers. So you can see the size difference in those. So I'm either going to have to not run those or take them to an upholstery shop and like have them shortened. I don't think that's going to work either. So I'll probably just leave them off and leave the dingy gray headrest for now until I break out the carpet cleaner and I can clean them up a little bit better. All right, so I put the Frontier covers over the Xterra headrest. And while it's not perfect, there's some you know, obvious extra material there. It looks better than it did just being the dingy, you know, gray. So at least they somewhat match now. So impressions on the new seat covers. Uh, this is what it did on my last one. It's kind of like, kind of bows up right here. So I don't really enjoy that, but I don't sit over here. I think it'll break in a little bit more and it'll start sitting down kind of in that corner right here after it wears in a little bit. And then same thing on the passenger side. It's almost like this seat cover is too big. So it, there's no room for it to tuck underneath here. So it just kind of bubbles right here on the side, which I'm not a big fan of. Um, the buckles, although they haven't broken yet, I did have one break on my last set. Overall, they're pretty decent fitting seat covers. They definitely keep your stuff a lot safer than having nothing. Uh, these are a lot heavier than the old seat covers were. I don't know if that's because, you know, material had worn off over time or... Uh, the neoprene is just actually that much thicker than the neo supreme that they call it, but The blues growing on me, so that's good because it's in here now and they're not coming back out but overall quality seat covers from cover king and Yeah, if you got any questions drop them in the comments